గుడ్ మార్నింగ్ యుఎస్ వెల్కమ్ టు కోనసీమ షార్ట్ హ్యాండ్ క్లాసెస్ గెట్ స్టడీ ఫైవ్ సెకండ్స్ ఐ వెల్కమ్ దిస్ ఆపర్చునిటీ ఫర్ టూ రీజన్స్ ఫస్ట్లీ ఇట్ గివ్స్ మీ అన్ ఆపర్చునిటీ టు రిమూవ్ సమ్ మిస్ గివింగ్స్ ఇట్ విల్ ఆల్సో గివ్ మీ అట్ ది సేమ్ టైమ్ an opportunity to clarify some of the details of this statement before doing that i would like to make a few observations and these are that some members have expressed views that so far as the matter of food is concerned it has to be treated as a national issue I do agree with those who have suggested that so far as this problem is concerned let us have a national outlook and let us not bring politics into it let us try to see how we can overcome the difficulties with which we are faced and how we can make food available to our people at a reasonable price the second thing which i would like to point out is this i think the time has come when we should be clear in our mind that this is not because of prejudices or prejudicial ideologies that we have placed a certain policy before this conference and before the country last year we thought that the taking over of food grains would help us in having an effective control over the surplus so that there may be no scope for speculators on the one hand and there may be no spiraling of prices on the other hand and it may be possible for us to provide the food grains which are the essential commodities for the existence of our people at a reasonable price and particularly the weaker sections that was the main objective underlying this policy so far as procurement is concerned that was a procedure in order to implement that particular policy and today when some people say that we have revised our policy or that we have surrendered our policy i do not agree with such a view of course my friends did not expect much good out of the policy which we had initiated last year and they also did not expect any good out of the policy which we have enunciated this time but they have not told us what is the better policy which can serve the objectives which we have placed before our zones i would like to point out one thing there is no question of surrender and there is no question of going back on our policy i can reiterate and emphasize that so far as this government and our party are concerned we accept the socialist path as the proper path for the purpose of development and progress of this country we are very clear about this we shall pursue this path maybe that we may have to change the emphasis from time to time maybe we may have to change the direction from time to time but we hope that the goal that we have set before ourselves 
will be achieved in the long run now the question before us is why the policy which we had placed previously and was accepted was not a success there are number of reasons for this one of the main reasons was the very same people who are now criticizing us had created such a psychology in the country that it was not for us to obtain food grains from the cultivators so far as food is concerned let us not have politics in that let us all try to see if we can have a program in which all parties can be combined together and make that progress a success through which only we can make the socialist method of living a success in a democratic setup this thing has got to be considered some members have very rightly pointed out that apart from the policy or the ideology we have to see from the practical angle how we can increase food production of food grains particularly cereals in our country so far as that matter is concerned a large number of suggestions have been made some have suggested that implementation of land reforms is a must they have said that so far as cases pending against cultivators are concerned they must be disposed of quickly dear sir the board of directors of fertilizers and chemicals limited are aware that the plant at kakinada is slated to commence its regular production shortly hence it is proposed that the next meeting of the board of directors be held there to enable our directors to personally see the plant and the progress of work at site a very very important personage is likely to inaugurate the plant and dedicate it to the farmers of the nation during december next the probable date could be around 20th december subject to receipt of confirmation from the chief guest the next board meeting of the company is scheduled to be held on the 17th november at plant site to coincide with the formal inauguration of the plant directors therefore may be required to stay at the plant site for at least two days in the light of the above position you are requested to inform us your travel plans for making suitable arrangements you may kindly plan to reach this place by middle of december arrangements for travel from railway station to the plant site will be made by the company any change in the above program will be intimated to you the agenda and notes for the board meeting will be sent to you in due course in this connection i would like to bring to your notice that there are important historical places of interest besides old temples around this place and one should not miss the opportunity of seeing them i would suggest that you should make it convenient to visit them if you agree we will plan accordingly and take you round you may also plan to spend 
वन आर टू डेज मोर टू सी द ऑल इंडिया कल्चरल फेस्टिवल बींग ऑर्गनाइज हिया थैंकिंग यू यूर्स फेथफुली